and it's going to be HPE, a stock that on the 10th, a week ago today, the stock was trading down hard. I think it was down like 11 or 12 percent on that day. And Pete said buy it. And was he right? Well, it turns out there was unusual activity. So somebody might have been listening to Pete when he said buy it down there. And how has that trade worked out? Well, you tell me. There's the October 17 calls that were bought when the stock traded down to 1655. Today, the stock rocking and rolling to the upside, Pete, HPE is. Um, it gets like a Bank America upgrade. It traded as high today as 1840. That's nearly $2 higher, folks. Almost back to where it was before that big drop that we talked about a week ago. Well, one of the things that I saw there, John, was it just seemed like the, it finally got beat up enough that it was probably time to turn and burn. And the reason I said that was I was looking at the PE in single digits. I mean, you're looking at profit to earnings and you're in the eights or nines, and that's a forward looking thing. That is, that's a pretty interesting level. And I thought it would, it made some sense. Now all of a sudden you've got this analyst out there who's also talking about, hey, prices going from 21 to 24 or whatever it is. I think Bank of America is probably right here. Has it been beat up a lot? Yes. Have they bought something that, that's really going to be very um, moving for them? I think so. They got that Juniper thing, John. We're talking about a $14 billion acquisition. That could be something that really makes them a lot more cost efficient. That's why I think people are starting to wake up a little bit to HPE. Well, uh, it, it would have been great timing if you bought the stock last week, folks. But if you bought the options, how well did you do in those options? I mean, buying those options gave you the leverage to make hundreds, plural, hundreds of percent return versus, oh yeah, great. You made uh, 12% or 14% um, if you bought it at 1655 and it went to 1840. You decide. All it's right. It's not an option. <laughs> it's not an option. That's right. It's not an option to just trade stocks. It's not an option. It's not an option. You got to get the book, folks. Go to itsnotanoption.com. And uh, the book's free. Shipping will cost you nine bucks or so. It's not an option. <laughs>